Hmm, guys, this is very, very emotional. Hmm. See the emotional moment Cora Obidi walked into her daughter, June, crying to see her dad. This is very sad, like, guys. Very sad. Hi, guys. It's your girl, Yohame Bonebo. Thank you so much to my subscribers. If this is your first time of coming across this channel, please do well to click on the subscription button and then click on the bell icon so that whenever we bring you the latest gist you'll be among the first person to view it now without wasting much of our time let's roll it a video of dancer cora obidi's two-year-old daughter june crying to see her dad amid their divorce saga has teared reactions online like guys the video was very very emotional like seriously in the video that found its way to the internet the mother of two walked in on her older daughter june crying to see her father like guys on seeing her cora carried june and tried to calm her down telling her that the mommy was here but the little girl insisted that she wanted to see her dad justin yeah you know Guys, it's no longer news that Cora's four-year marriage to her American husband is on the verge of hitting the rock. As her husband was reportedly stated that he's divorcing her. Of course, I'm sure you guys saw the video. The video made rounds, serious rounds on social media. In a series of social media posts, he accused her of being unbothered about the unbothered marital crisis. And has continued to speak out on what he allegedly went through in the man marriage. Recently, he shared an interesting post that subtly mirrors the situation going on in their union. He wrote about the way men who walk away from toxic relationships are viewed like vice guys, versa. The video was a very sad video. Ah, I can only imagine what children from broken home they go through. Like seriously is not easy especially on their children you know it's not always easy but of course if you are in a toxic relationship in a toxic marriage it is better you just leave leave and let's leave there are so many women out there that they are suffering abuse from their husband but they are still there until one 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 way or the other you will hear say ah the husband don't do this the husband don't do that before you know na early grave so this one forget all this one say children they cry if the if you if you as a parent dying now the they'll be only ones the picking go cry keep quiet at least it's certain that the, the the daughter will still see her father you know I just pray me god help them god should help their marriage god should help their marriage the video was a very sad one like guys the child was just wanted to see her dad she just want to see her dad she was just crying, like seriously. My heart goes out to those people, those children in broken homes. You know, easy. You know, you know, easy. But of course, toxic relationship too is not easy. You cannot stay in a home whereby you are being abused. No, it's not advisable. If you're not happy and you have stayed, you have made, tried to make things work for you to be happy in such relationship, in your marriage or in your relationship, if you, are, if you are still not happy, despite all your efforts, it's better you separate. Yes. It's better you separate and find happiness elsewhere. Like, seriously. I pray my disciples work their issues out, you know. And the child, of course, the child will be allowed to see her dad now. You know. Anyway, guys, leave your comments in the comment section.